If you're looking for a race, go see Jackie Weeks. He's in the back of town. You can't miss him. Just look for the big inflatable gorilla. If you're looking for Mayor Clayton, he's right over there. The mayor and Sheriff Black run this town. Don't start any trouble and keep to yourself, and you'll be fine. You do? I'd like to be one of the first to welcome you to our little town. It's a decent place and the authority doesn't come around much. Not sure where you came from, but everyone is welcome here in Wellspring. If you haven't spoken with our mayor yet, I'd do it right quick. Haven't seen anyone dressed like that in a long time. Will you look at how you're dressed? I haven't seen anyone wearing an arc suit for a long time. Dangerous thing you're doing there. Be careful. Authority spots you and you'll be hauled away in a flash. You best keep as low a profile as you can around here. Don't let people know you're from the past. Rewards are large for turning one of you in. But lucky for you, I hate the authority more than I need money. This is Mayor Clayton's town. He founded it and convinced just about everyone to live here. Safety in numbers, he said. And he was right. As long as you're in town, you'll be safe. But out in the wasteland, well, that's a different story. Old man Clayton sure is a good mayor. He really cares about this town and the people in it. If you're looking for work, I would try Sally's. She's always got stuff that needs to be done. Sure I saw them. Mutants, 10, 20 of them. All over that valley. I had a hold of someone, just ripping them apart. That's why you'll never catch me leaving here. Never. I hear the mutants are spreading into the settlements, dead things. Soon they'll be busting down the town gates. Listen, you ever spot a mutant, you kill it quick. Those things are only trouble. You look lost. If you're looking for a drink, head to Sally's. If you're looking to race, go talk to Jackie in the back of town. Take my advice, stranger. Keep a low profile around here. You start attracting too much attention, and next thing you know, authority will be wanting to talk with you. And you don't want that.
You're new here. Stranger, huh? <laughs> yeah, you do look pretty strange. Welcome to Wellspring, stranger. Best little town this side of what passes for civilization and a few good safe miles from any authority outposts. Nicest people you'll ever find live right here. Friendly folk, not your wasteland bandit scum. Good honest people. Well, enough with all that. So I hear you have a message from our friend Dan. Let's have it then. Having some trouble with bandits in the settlement again. Dangerous life out there. Deadly, even. Well, I can get all this stuff he needs. Gonna take some time, though. Not sure how long. He must really respect you to give you this important job. So for now, I'll trust you, too. You can stay here at Wellspring while I'll get his supplies, but not dress like that. You'll bring the authority sniffing around, and I sure don't need that. So, you'll need to lose the arc suit for something a bit more... Modern. <laughs> Go see the vendor in town. Get some new clothes. I don't care what you do with that suit, as long as no one sees you in it again. You blend in. Understand? Good. Glad we understand each other. When you come back, we can have another little chat. I told you, you gotta get out of that arc suit before the authority comes by and picks you up. There's always some fool Attention willing to risk his money just to take a little of yours. If you find yourself low on cash, these games are a great way to make a little extra. Unfortunately, there have been reports of price gouging, hoarding, and unfair business practices. The character of this town is its people, and we must all work together to... Sarah, if I knew anything, anything about the Scorchers, I would have told you already. Clive, you're making this worse. Just tell me what they're up to. I really don't see why it's necessary to keep this up. I mean, honestly, if I were withholding information, do you really think I'd risk this? How many drinks can I serve with only one hand or one foot? Or worse, come on, Sarah, cut it out. No, don't worry I'll about Clive over there. We'll he talk. used to be a Scorcher, on, please. but he couldn't cut it. Now he has to hide out here to dodge his old crew. Anyway, you look like you've been through hell. What did you find at the refinery? Firestorm is a flying gunship and, and slick as fuel? If they're close to getting this off the ground, no one will be safe, not even in Wellspring. Time's up, Clive! Wait, wait! I can get you into their base! And why should I believe you? If I know the Scorchers, they'll kill everybody. Including me. So how do I shut it down? Oh no! If they find out that I helped you, then there ain't nothing in Wellspring that'll keep me safe. Next to them, you're just a bully. A uh, hot bully. Ugh, oh, fine. What's it gonna take? Just get me out of the wasteland. As far from the Scorchers as possible. 
<laughs> Please, you can't be serious. I'd need my own ship to get you that far. Look, I'm screwed either way. Find me a way out or deal with Firestorm on your own. I suggest you talk to J.K. Styles about his latest promotion. I hear Oasis is beautiful this time of year. We don't have much choice. We need Clive's help if we're gonna do this. I'll keep an eye on him here. You get a ticket from Styles. If you have trouble getting into Bash TV, talk to the race promoter in town. How about a game of chance? The game is short and sweet, just like me. Place bets on any of your lucky numbers and spin the wheel. Maybe next time. Hope to see you soon. I don't think Clive is going to talk until he gets that ticket to Oasis.